great day. And to end off this great day, I'm going to have a great video for all of you and a great book. The book is Ricky Ricotta's Mighty Robot. And I was explaining, I do my rough drafts, copies, whatever you want to call them, to my family. And they said, you got to explain who Ricky is. Because they didn't understand, oh, is that the writer, is that the main character, who is this guy? So, just to put it out there right now, Dave Pilkey is the author, and Ricky is the main character. Now, like, Ricky is a little mouse who always gets bullied because he's small. He's naturally born small. So... Each day he hopes something big will happen for him. And one day in the mountains, there's this evil mad scientist who's been kicked out of the city because he's a criminal. And he has this all crazy lab, potions over there, robotics over there, and his grand masterpiece, a robot. And this robot has eyes for lasers like Superman, it can fly, it can super speed punch, it can do everything. And so the robot and the scientist are coming down the mountains to the town to get his revenge. And Ricky's having a normal day at school and everything goes as planned until the robot comes. They don't notice it because they're on the other side of town and the mountains are over here. So, well, you're going to have to get through the main part of the city than us, that's cool. And so the robot starts causing devastation, destroying everything, throwing cars, hitting people. Punching houses. Like, I. It's crazy. And. But the robot. Comes. Into focus. And sees all this. And he's a good robot. Not a bad robot. And so he starts. Helping people back up to their feet. Flipping cars back on their. Prop, on their wheels. Trying to fix houses back as much as possible without breaking them even more. And Ricky's in the right spot at the right time, coincidentally, and he's being picked on by the bullies on his way home to school, from school. And the robot picks up the bullies and tells them no and sets them back far farther away from Ricky and steps in between Ricky and the bullies. And the bullies run back to their houses and Ricky and the robot become best friends after that. And they go to Ricky's house. And Ricky gets to keep the robot as a friend and a pet. So that's all for this book today. Uh, it's an 8 out of 5. And I'd say the age is a 6 and up. And the book is in the description, as well, always, for a great deal. So that's it for today. See ya!